One thing that can be really frustrating with Google Spreadsheets is reading the data, especially if some of the data is large chunks of text, excuse me, text, like you see on this particular spreadsheet. Um, when, it's, when you have these chunks of text that are like paragraphs, you don't see many rows in, in a view, and it's hard when you have the really long answers to really absorb what you want to absorb. So um, what I do is I use one of my favorite scripts called View Responses. So I'm going to show you how that works. So in this particular spreadsheet, it is filled in from a form. And in the form, it is a sign up for District Tech Camp. And so the last three questions are asking the respondents to describe what they want to do or what they want to learn um, during that tech camp. So let's close that out. And then we're going to go back to the spreadsheet. And I'm going to show you what the form excuse me, what the script will do. You go under Tools to the Script Gallery to find this script, and I never remember the name of it, but I do know that it has something to do with form submissions, so I always type in the word form, and that um, makes the list you have to look through shorter, but I just also happen to know that this is way at the bottom. So here it is, View Responses. So you click on Install, and this one's a little bit funky, because I do get a couple errors, but if, if you are persistent, it always works. So I get the installed message and I close out of there. And then I need to go under tools again to the script manager, because once you install a script, then you have to run it. So there it is. This is the name of the script, view responses. And now I'm going to run it. This is where I often get an error, but if I do it a couple times, it works every single time. So I click on run, which is a button at the bottom, and then I click on authorize. And it says now you can run the script. And if I close this, nothing actually happened because I would notice a new tab at the bottom. So I'm like, okay, well, that's weird. But truly, you run it a couple times and it works. I'm not sure why. So I said run again. And I saw something happen behind me, so now I know it's working. Every once in a while I get an error about line 15, and if I just run it again, it works. So I click close. Now, what this does is it takes all of your questions and it lays it out in one column and the answers in the right column for a single submission. So this is so great. So this is the first person who submitted this form. If I type in a two and press return, that's the second submission and three and press return. And in many cases, this is a much um, more resourceful way to um, really process the data that came in from your form. So running that script results in a, an additional tab in the bottom of your spreadsheet called the Worksheets tab, where you can see one submission at a time.